So it's more like a bluish black, but yeah, that's gonna work just fine for what we have planned. So I have this cool idea. Well, it's cool in my head. I don't know if it's actually cool, but I want to make a nightlight, but I want to make like a, you know, one of those, those shake up globes nightlights. I want to put something in there, put resin around it, have a clear ball with like something that glows in there. And I think I know how we can do it. How cool does that look under the UV light? It's done. So I know what you're thinking right now. What the heck is this thing that, that he's used twice now in this video? This is a UV resin curing box that I made out of an old Tupperware box. And also what I did is I put the metallic uh, duct tape under in, or in the inside of this and then I put UV lights. And the turntable in there is solar powered so the UV lights run it. Simple, right?
Don't judge me, I can't find my other saw. Oh, you're starting to piss me off. All right, so there's cracks in here from, I didn't seal this wood like I should have, and now there's cracks down here where the air didn't want to let the wood and the resin contact. It's about totally disconnected here. That's scary.
Okay, I have to stop this project now. Um, my idea was to do that crystal ball sort of thing where it glows, and I was going to, I don't know where the stuff is at, but I was going to have it glow from the bottom, and then I decided I needed to put a bigger light in there because it wasn't glowing right, and the resin wasn't clear. Let me, hold on a second, let me bring this up here. So look at the resin. It's so cloudy and I don't know why it did that. It should have worked fine. I used thick, thick set um, and when I did, I didn't seal this at all. So this whole section right here is not really attached in there. Um, it is now. I put super glue in there or the CA glue, Starbond. And it's, all right. But my big issue is while I had it on the lathe, I should have drilled out the bottom portion here, and I didn't. And I've been trying to drill this out and hammer it out, and it's just too much. Um, it, things taking way too long. So I'm gonna put this on the shelf. Maybe I'll fix it some other day. Um, my my thoughts of doing this right here, that's eh, not really a great look either. Everything went wrong with this thing. So I'm going to call it quits on this one for now. I'll put it up on the shelf of shame and maybe one day I'll finish it. Uh, this is the hardest part and I can't seem to get it drilled out. I've tried to clamp it and drill it with a Forstner bit, drill this out, and it's just not working out. It's falling down and I've freaking tore up a shirt, got a cut in the shirt and all that stuff. So I sometimes it happens. Sometimes things that you imagine are going to look amazing look like... I'm just saying. I mean, that is horrible. Look at it. Now, the little man inside there is all translucent and stuff, and I thought it'd be cool because if I put a, I had just a little LED that was going to go up in there, but it didn't. It didn't come out. <laughs> if you look over to, to my left, your right, there's a donate button. That donate button goes to the Humane Society of Cherokee County. If you could, please donate a few dollars and realize that anything that's donated in this link right here is going to be matched by myself. Uh, also realize that any sales from Moon Pie Creations, 10% of it goes to the Humane Society on top of anything that you donate over here. If you could, head on down, hit that thumbs up button, share the video, and if you want to, hit that subscribe button. If you don't, I just appreciate you watching my video. And until next video, stay cool.